Hi guys, so today we're going to be answering the question, is 3 eighths bigger than 1 half? And we're going to be going through three ways to compare fractions that will help us understand whether 3 eighths is bigger than 1 half. So let's just start with an overview of the three ways to compare fractions. So the first is to make the denominators the same and then compare the numerators. The second is to make two pie charts and compare them visually. And the third is to divide the numerators by the denominators and compare the decimals. So let's start with the first method, which is making the denominators the same and then comparing the numerators. So we've got 3 eighths and 1 half, and we need to make the denominators the same. So the easiest way to do this is by multiplying the numerator and denominator of 1 half by 4. So we're going to do 1 times 4 and 2 times 4, which gives us 4 eighths. So this allows us to much more easily compare the fractions because now we have 3 eighths and 4 eighths. So all we have to do is look at and compare the numerators. So we have 3 eighths and 4 eighths. 4 is greater than 3, so therefore 4 eighths is greater than 3 eighths. So therefore, by comparing the numerators, we can see that 1 half is greater than 3 eighths. The next method is to create two pie charts and visually compare them. So we've got 3 eighths on the left here. We're going to divide our pie into eight parts. And on the right, we have 1 half, so we're going to divide it into two parts. Because we only have three out of eight parts for 3 eighths, we're going to color in three of the wedges, three of the slices in our pie chart. Whereas 1 half, we only have one out of the two parts, so we're going to color in one of our two slices, one of our two wedges. And this very easily allows us to see that 1 half is greater than 3 eighths. We can see that more of the pie is shaded in for 1 half than it is for 3 eighths. And our final method to determine whether 3 eighths is bigger than 1 half is to divide the numerators by the denominators and compare the decimal numbers. So let's just go ahead and do that. We have 3 eighths. Uh, 3 divided by 8 gives us 0.375. And then we have 1 half, 1 divided by 2 equals 0 0.5. So just by looking at the decimals, we can see that 0 0.5 is greater than 0 0.375. So once again, we can come to the conclusion that 1 half is greater than 3 eighths. So our final answer um, that we got from all of these methods of comparing fractions is that no, 3 eighths is not bigger than 1 half. So hopefully you found this video helpful and you know how to compare fractions a little bit better. Thanks for stopping by and we'll see you next time.